Hi, my name is Erica Riley, and I want to thank you for granting me the position as a psychiatric nurse. Um, I want to go over a few things which are my career goals. The first thing for my career goals is I want to be able to open up a group home for the intellectual disabled and the developmental disabled in a, um, nor in a regular normal neighborhood to promote um, normalization not only for nurses but everyone around us and also to educate people that do and do not understand their diagnosis. Also, I wanted to gain the experience as a psychiatric nurse to also to maintain a higher position to become a charge nurse at the end. And that's one of my um, main goals as a career. And then also one of the biggest career goals in my eyes is being an advocate for everyone that can and cannot stand up for themselves even when um like i said before even when they are they are they are are not around we are still able to stand up for them and i want to just educate myself and continue educating myself as um just being a better advocate also um I want to go over a few things as a in the work I, in the work environment where I can work in both groups and by myself and the reason why I say that is because I can work by myself as in I can get things done and also which I'm big on is continuing my education so that's where the part where I work very well by myself and also I work um, very well with working in groups also because I feel like working in groups make the job day um, easier and also it promotes a stronger and better foundation for our team and the type of environment that I would love to work in honestly is a state hospital and the reason why for a state hospital because we're able to help maintain and treat not just regular you know um regular symptoms but we're able to help and maintain dual diagnosis and you know to better understand what's going on so we can be um better educators for everyone and also um i want to work at a state hospital because it just i feel like it's a better it's a better feel for myself like i feel like when I'm in a state hospital, it keeps me on my feet. It keeps me to get to know the clients better and to understand that it's not just a diagnosis. It also goes in with their history. I also want to say thank you for your time and have a good night.